It's 10 trivia questions on 8-bit songs. I'm going to play some Nintendo-esque versions of hit songs, and you got to try and identify the song title and the artist. This is Trivia with Buds. All right, guys, here we go. For all these, I'll play about five or six seconds of the song, and you have to identify which uh, song it is from the world of pop culture. These are all pretty popular songs, so give them a listen. Rewind if you have to, and here we go. We're going to play each song one time, and here's number one. Song number two. Here comes song number three. Moving on to song number four. Song number five. Here's song six. Number seven. Here is your eighth song, number eight. Song number nine. And song number ten. There they were, everybody, the 8-bit versions of some popular songs. We'll be back in just a second to see how many you got right out of 10. We are back with the answers to 8-bit songs from my friend Brent Barkey. We're going to go over those answers. Here was number one. And the answer there was Hey Ya by Outkast. Hey Ya by Outkast. Here was number two. That was Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jepsen. Did you get that one? That was hard at first for me, but then I was able to figure it out. Number three. That was Baby One More Time by Britney Spears, a song that's over 20 years old. Baby One More Time. I just saw that NSYNC's Bye 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 uh, no Strings Attached album came out exactly 20 years ago. That made me feel old. I can't believe that was 20 years ago. Number four. And that was Tub Thumping. Tub Thumping by Chumba Wumba. Uh, get knocked down. Get back up again. You're never going to keep me down. That's perfect. That's a good chant for the quarantine that we're all going through. Here's number five. That was Stacy's Mom, She's Got It Going On by the Fountains of Wayne. Number five, Stacy's Mom. Here was number six. That, of course, was Thriller by Michael Jackson. Thriller by Michael Jackson. And number seven. 
This was a tough one. We played it a bunch in my house when I was trying to figure these out. My wife and I could not get it. And then I got it at the last second. Hey There Delilah by the Plain White Tees, a band out of Chicago. Hey There Delilah. Number eight. Number eight was Living on a Prayer, Bon Jovi, one of my favorites of all time. Living on a Prayer, Bon Jovi. And here's the song for number nine. That's Fireflies by Owl City. Fireflies by Owl City. Did you get that one? I thought that was kind of tough, but also that song's kind of electronic and 8-bit sounding anyway. So there you go. Here we go with number 10. And the answer to number 10 was Black Beatles by Ray Sremerd. Uh, I've heard that song a million times, didn't know the artist, never knew the title, but now I know. So there you go. I hope you had fun with that quiz from Brent Barkey. I know I did. And Brent uh, hosts trivia in Minnesota and is a uh, great dad, according to his Instagram pictures. He's always doing fun stuff with the family. So shout out to Brent Barkey. And uh, thank you for sending me those questions. If you guys ever have rounds like that, audio rounds without copywritten music, when you do like a, a remix or an 8-bit version like that, I can usually insert it and not have to worry about it getting taken down. So if you have anything like that, uh, royalty-free music or remixed music that you want to use on a future trivia quiz, send it my way, ryanbuds at gmail.com. All right, it's time for the question of the day. Question of the day coming up right now is, what is Gonzo's main chicken friend's name on the Muppets? What is Gonzo's main chicken friend's name on the Muppets? Tweet me your answers at Ryan Buds or email ryanbuds at gmail.com to be eligible for a prize. Yesterday's question of the day answer was Alaska for AK, the first state alphabetical by postal code. And your trivia team name of the day is Smokey and the Band-Aid. Smokey and the Band-Aid. Rest in peace, Burt Reynolds. Thank you guys so much for playing trivia with me today. Thanks for telling a friend about the show, and we'll see you tomorrow for more Trivia with Buds. Cheers! 